Good evening. I am Wade Martin, the proud principal of Dunellen High School, and I want to welcome you to this evening's 2021 commencement ceremony. Graduates, please remain standing. Families, please stand for the presentation of the colors and then remain standing for the national anthem.
You may be seated. Class of 2021, through most of last March until today, you have faced adversity and hardship with extraordinary courage, tenacity, and fortitude. As I visited some of your classes in person, on Microsoft Teams, and on Zoom, you handled yourselves with grace and compassion. As I reminded you and your families in most of my messages home this year, you continue to do an excellent job of following the guidelines set forth by the CDC. You are here today because of your hard work and should be commended. Everyone, please join me in giving our class of 2021 a round of applause. I would like to thank Cox Communications for providing our graduates with their beautiful honor cords. And now for our honored guests on stage. As I say your name, please stand. Superintendent of Marion County Schools, Dr. Diane Gullett. Deputy Superintendent, Mr. Mark Vianello. School board member, Reverend Eric Cummings. Area Director for Secondary Schools, Mr. Ben Whitehouse. Please join me in recognizing some key players in making sure our students were able to successfully complete their graduation requirements. First and foremost, I'd like to thank the amazing DHS teachers who worked hard to make sure that you were able to be here today. I would also like to thank my DHS administrative team, Mr. Samuel McLean, Assistant Principal for Curriculum, Mrs. Pamela Fritz, Assistant Principal for Instruction, Mr. Samuel Bullock, Assistant Principal for Discipline, as well as the DHS staff who worked very closely with our seniors, Mrs. Linda Koff, Senior Counselor, Mrs. Juliana Salaji, senior sponsor, and Mrs. Kim Heitmuller, graduation coordinator who helped to plan this outstanding ceremony. And now, a quick spoken word from one of your classmates. How else can I compete with all the noise if God didn't give me this wonderful voice? I use it to yell, I use it to scream, I use it to tell you my hopes and my dreams. It could tell you a story or sing you a song, I read you a poem or cheer you along. To give you some confidence or tell you a compliment, it lives in a box inside my esophagus. My voice, yeah, my voice is unique. It sets me apart from the crowd when I speak. You don't have to look and you know that it's me just by the pitch and the tone in my speech. It's soft when I whisper and loud when I'm bragging. It puts into words anything I imagine. It speaks from the depths of my soul and my spirit. Thank God for my voice. I'm so glad you could hear it. Thank you, Christian Fashaw, for sharing a few encouraging words with your class. Good evening again, graduates, parents, and dignitaries. Thank you so much for being a part of this evening's commencement ceremony. I know you're very proud to see your students walk across the stage, and rightly so. This class has much to be proud of. Let me start by taking a few moments to focus on some academic achievements of the class of 2021. This class consists of 239 graduates, most of whom are here this evening. Of those 239 graduates, 54% of our students are graduating with a 3.0 or higher. Thirty of our seniors have attained at least three or more college credits, while quite a few more are awaiting AP and Cambridge test results, and one of those students have completed their Associates of Arts degree from the College of Central Florida. Twenty-nine students are graduating with a GPA of a 4.0 or above. Two students have completed all their high school coursework in three years. 
This graduating class should be proud of all these accomplishments. It has been the standard at Donnellan High for many years. In addition to what I've already mentioned, Donnellan High School is known for doing well in sports, and this year we continue that tradition. Our football team won the district championship, and we advanced to the final four, just one game from playing for the state championship. The class of 2021 has four students signed to play athletics at the collegiate level. Yet another great feat that our seniors can be proud of. Today's class of 2021 would not be here if it were not for the hard work of their families that are in the stands here supporting them this evening. Our DHS family, as I refer to them, my faculty and staff, have put forth a concerted effort to ensure the success of these graduates that sit here before you. So hats off to them as well. I would like to take this time to recognize our graduates that will be enlisting in the military. Graduates, if you will be enlisting in any of the armed services, please stand. Remain standing. Remain standing. At, this time, At this time, I would also like to ask like anyone in attendance who has, served, who has served or is currently or serving, serving in our armed, in armed forces, forces to stand, to stand in, union in union with these seniors. Thank you, students, for your willingness to serve and protect our country. We are very proud of you. Thank you, family and friends, for your service to our country and the great role models you have been to our students following in your footsteps. You may be seated. Graduates, let me leave you with a few final thoughts on this very important day. Change is the law of life. And those who look only to the past and the present are certain to miss the future. John F. Kennedy. There are many challenges that came with this school year. In fact, we could probably sit here for hours contemplating about all the frustrations this year has brought for us. However, I urge you today to reflect on all the positive things that, you have, res that have resulted from this challenging year. Change is never easy for anyone but without it, there would be no progress. Typically, when asked to change, something that is something that we fight tooth and nail. Oftentimes, this prevents us from growing and progressing in life. This school year has forced us to make changes. And yes, at first, we were resistant, but those changes have brought to the surface many positive transformations. I look out at all the seniors today and I am so proud of the way that you have come together this year to support each year. You hear many people criticize today's youth, but I see a group of young adults who focus on the needs of others and have become advocates for mental health, equal rights for their peers. I see a group of young people who have become even more creative this year and innovative with the use of technology in their learning, as well as being mindful of the health and safety of not just themselves, but the people around them. So as you graduate today, stand proud and do not let anyone look down on you because you are young. Instead, continue to set an example for others as you go out into the workforce, into the armed services, or off to college. Use the challenges of this year as an advantage. Learn from them and be the ones who move us forward to an even better tomorrow. I am so proud of you. You are my first full graduating class as the principal of Donnellan High School. I've watched you grow. I've watched you grow from freshman year to here before me as graduating seniors. You will always have a special place in my heart and you will always 
be a tiger. This year's salutatorian is Aiden Leeds. Aiden is the son of Jennifer and Jonathan Leeds. During his time here at DHS, Aiden was in the Advanced Studies Program, as well as the Power Generation Academy, two magnet programs here at DHS. He was also a member of National Honor Society for three years, student government for four years, and is the current SGA president. Additionally, Aiden has been a student ambassador and is in the Robotics Club, of which he is also the president. Aiden has been an active in athletics, playing golf for three years and tennis for two. Aiden has received several awards, including the Hugh O'Brien Youth Leadership Award, the Leadership Ocala Marion Youth Award, and our Boys State Representative. Aiden is a dedicated and dependable young man who has worked hard to attain his 58 college credits. And Aiden will be graduating today with a 4.71 GPA. Aiden will be attending Aiden will be attending the University of Florida in the fall, where he will study electrical engineering. Ladies and gentlemen, Aiden Leeds. Good evening, and most importantly, congratulations, class of 2021. I've spent these last few days trying to decide what exactly I would share in my speech. I thought about reminiscing these past four years. But then I thought, why waste your time in thinking about what was, rather than looking forward to the possibilities that await each of us? When I was 10 years old, my Taekwondo instructor gave me a vocabulary lesson. I never realized how important of a lesson it was until now. I want to share with you this same quick lesson. So here it goes. Today's vocabulary word is perseverance. I know it's a big word. Just think of how big of a word it was for a 10-year-old. Now let's talk about what it means. Dictionary.com defines this word as a steady persistence in a course of action, a purpose, a state, etc., especially in spite of difficulties, obstacles, or, dis or discouragement. At the time I learned this word, it was supposed to help me stay focused in meeting my goal to earn my black belt. And it did, but that vocabulary lesson actually continued to follow me through these past four years of high school to keep me focused on getting to where I am today. I share this vocabulary lesson with you today because you too have demonstrated great perseverance up to this point. From the first day many of us met at Freshman Connection until now, we have maintained a steady, persistent course of action in spite of difficulties and the most obvious obstacle of COVID-19. Aside from the personal challenges we each encountered, who would have ever thought we would have, we would have experienced the changes to our ways of life and learning in the last two years alone? It is because of your perseverance that you sit here today to be recognized as a graduate. Meeting the requirements to earn your high school diploma. But your perseverance should not and will not stop when we leave here. Tonight, you each sit here with goals for what comes next in your life. Whether your goals are for a year from now, four years from now, or even 10 years from now. Never forget the lesson of perseverance. As a class, we have persevered. We have what it takes to succeed when we set our minds to it, no matter what life throws our way. Many of us could honestly admit that it was not only our perseverance that supported us these past four years. DHS may be a small school, but there really is a great group of people inside, and they have done more than their share to help us get here this evening. There are a few people that I would like to personally acknowledge for the impact they've made on me. Mr. Sam McLean, 
Thank you for our morning conversations and helping me learn who I am. Thank you also to Mrs. Kim Heitmuller for her continued encouragement and great advice. And to Mr. Slocum, thank you for all of your guidance and knowledge you have taught me in the shop. And one huge thank you goes out to my parents and my family. Thank you for all of your support and for not only helping me get here tonight, but for helping me achieve my future goals that I have waiting for me. Last, but definitely not least, I would like to give a big thank you and congratulations to you, the DHS class of 2021. We have made it, Tigers. We persevered. Thank you. Thank you, Aiden. This year's valedictorian is Gugu Latu Sagogo. Gugu Latu is the daughter of Stella Nemesusu and Fabian Sagogo. During her time here at DHS, Gugu Latu was in the Advanced Studies Program. She was also a member of National Honor Society for three years, where she held the office of secretary for two of those years. Gugu Latu was a part of Student Support Foundation for three years, Fellowship of Christian Athletes and First Priority for three years, and in addition, she was a student ambassador. A few accolades that Gugu Latu wants to be able to attain during her time here at DHS were the Girl State Representative for DHS and a Sunshine State Collar. She participated in athletics such as basketball for four years, flag football for two years, and running track. A few additional achievements for Google Latu are her Microsoft Office certification that she attained, a score of a 1440 on her SAT, and she has accumulated 44 college credits. Google Latu will be graduating today with a 4.75 GPA. and attending the University of Central Florida in the fall, where she will study computer science. Ladies and gentlemen, Google it too, Sagogo. Thank you, Mr. Martin. Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it's a great day to be a tiger. <laughs> First and foremost, I would like to thank God for making all this possible. On behalf of the Denellen High School Class of 2021, I would like to welcome family, friends, alumni, alumni, faculty, and staff to this special occasion. Thank you for being here today. More importantly, thank you for being here yesterday and these past four years. I'm Goo, and to the graduates, we went to high school together. Today is a monumental day. Today is a day of celebration. Graduating from high school occurs only once in a lifetime, and all of us here are success stories. We managed to obtain this achievement through these perilous times. We survived. We survived the Alice Protocols. We survived the hurricanes. We survived the presidential election. We survived the social distancing. We survived the backlash of the opinionated media and we survived the hot girl and hot boy summers. <laughs> the journey we encompassed in high school is very easily related with the words of Gloria Gaynor, I will survive, starting with freshman year. At first I was afraid, I was petrified. <laughs> Kept thinking I could never live without you by my side. We were no longer the reigning eighth graders in middle school, now fresh meat of uncharted territory. Finding the correct colored hallway was not only confusing, but the bodies in the center comments made navigation to class way more difficult. The first appearance, appearance to high school, new faces, new cliques, and now the first objective to find where to fit in. We entered a point of our lives where mommy and daddy no longer were holding our hands down the hallway. Luckily, Denellen High School is equipped with the finest caring staff like Mr. Martin, Ms. Fritz, Ms. Darmody, 
and Miss Lucky and many more who helped us get situated along the way. It took all the strength I had not to follow Pop, and I grew strong, and I learned how to get along, making new friendships, working on old ones, losing friendships, building and breaking relationships. Over the course of high school, we've grown together. During these times, we learned to find ourselves whilst working towards this very goal. Glow ups, glow downs, homecoming, prom, praying for school breaks, joining sports team, winning games, losing more, finding the perfect club, last minute homework completion, advanced classes, college prep, applications, enlistments, a first job. These are all but a portion of the experience we shared over these last four years. Just to pa that just flew past. Shared trials and tribulations, triumphs and defeats. I will survive. And we did survive. And graduation is only the beginning. It was our hard work and dedication that granted us this opportunity to walk across the stage. Our time spent in high school may have seemed tedious, but the rewards we reap is golden. We've acquired the skills of self-discipline, self-confidence, and worth ethic. These attributes will be crucial in order to be successful in the next stage of our life. Along this journey, the support system of close friends is what anchored our sanity. Fortunately, I had the support of great friendships. My comedic relief, Janai Rockington, And I had The Voice, established 2017, Jonas Duncan, Caleb Lathrop, Jonathan Selner, Jonathan Nicholson, Elisha Thompson, Drew Leinenbach, <laughs> Cody and Barrett, who were ultimately my brothers. But now I hold my head up high and you see somebody new. This room is filled with promise. Every last one of us hold the potential to be great. Future doctors, engineers, scientists, farmers, activists, servicemen and women, athletes, teachers, electricians, lawyers, accountants, politicians. It's our jobs to fulfill these roles. The power to manage the future is here. We are the future. Sadly, our days in high school are complete. The days of school blacking out, the school catching on fire, then blacking out again, are now behind us. Today, we take our biggest step towards the future. In closing, I would like to reiterate what an honor it has been to grow and learn at Denellen High School. To stand here today and represent my class at Valedictorian, I believe this, is an, this achievement has permitted us to all claim the words of Kanye West. Everybody wants to know what I would do if I didn't win. I guess we'll never know. Why? Because we are the class of 2021. We survived. Thank you, Google Letter. And now for the presentation of diplomas. Ladies and gentlemen, before we present our graduates individually, we would like to remind those in attendance that this ceremony is meant to honor the accomplishments of each graduate. Out of respect and fairness to each one of these outstanding graduates, we would ask that when the graduate's name is called, please refrain from using air horns, cowbells, or other noisemakers to celebrate. Doing so may cause the next graduate and the family of the next graduate to miss the calling of his or her name. We want each student to receive the recognition they richly deserve. We will have the opportunity to join our seniors in the final celebration as the ceremony comes to an end. I thank you so much for your respect and co cooperation. At this time, we will begin the presentation of diplomas.
Gugula Tu, Natalie Sagogo. Aiden James Leeds. Iliana Acosta Escobar. Adriana Nicole Engelmeyer. Larina Joy Avina. Kaylee Ann Barr. Madison Michaela Bauer. Kate Jalice Benzant. Destiny Mystique Beeler. Janaya Monet Brockington. Kevin Roberto Carmona Figueroa. Isabella Rose Siosia. Alexandra Marie Corvo. Delaney Eve Cowan. Rory Juliana Crosby. Cameron Elizabeth Darnell. Jade Presley Deonath. Courtney Hope Decina. Jonas Tate Duncan. Dwayesha Tema Edwards. Kylie Winnell Follett. Haley Alexis Foster. Gabrielle Angel Garcia. Carlicia Monet Genlock. Leonardo Gomez Moreira. Shazina Hamid. Cody Allen Hawkins. Chad Lee Holland. Haley Renee Hollingshead. Samaria Danae Hopkins. Ron Dominic Eugene Janerone. Kiara Marie Louise Jones. Megan Lee Carrick. Jenna May King. Andrew Gregory Leinenbach. Jacqueline Marie Lemansky. Kurt William Lemaster Jr. Kaylin Renee Linder. Lacey Sharon Nicole McPherson. Ashley Matry. Gabrielle Alexander Martinez. Rosa Maria Medina Cerros. Rachel Marie Mobley. Adam Robert Mooney. Alana Riley Makana Puvai Moore. Janiel Armando Muñiz Hernandez. Ariana Faith Munoz. Jonathan David Nicholson. Layla Camille Nix. Stacy Elizabeth Rapp. 
Cheyenne Blaze Roberts, Caitlin Noel Robinson, Jamin Winston Rock, Jocelyn Rodriguez, Joseph Julian Romero, Summer Rose Royer, Joseph Anthony Santiago, Jonathan Joseph Selner, Colby James Smith, Jamie Lynn Smith, Riley Ann Smith, Leanne Sandra Sonneberger, Selena Vanessa Sukraj, Haley Lynn Cheyenne Stam, Taylor Nicole Stewart, Alicia Marie Taveras. Maya Nicole Taylor, Melody Hope Thomas, Ayla Nicole Thonin, Shayla Renee Thonin, Jennifer Trejo Ordonez, Kaylee Nicole Urban. Kelvin Xavier Alba. Tyler Lee Albert. Jocelyn Alfaro. Chad Jacob Ammon. Caroline Janice Arieta. Rafael Andres Avilés Pérez. Natalia Marie Avitia. Destin J. Banton. Haley Elizabeth Bourgeois. Avery Anthony Braden. Blaze Austin Mitchell Breeze. Destiny Ann Marie Breeze. Austin Matthew Brown. Tiana Alicia Brown. Georgie Rose Buchko. Deja Denise Burns. Nicholas Damien Boucher. Jeremy Antonio Campbell. Devin Michael Casey. Dylan Scott Cassidy. Christopher Sofrito Castillo Jr. Frederick Christian Charlot. Autumn Rain Shervenak. Kiera Alexa Ray Clayton. Jude Daryl. Cole, Angel Jose Cole Valdivia, Jaciel David Colón Valentin, Joseph Anthony Correa, Jose Miguel Coromina, Yuli Correa. Jasmine Leilani Couch. 
Angel Elija Cruz. Aurora del Mar Cruz Figueroa. Shanaimi Cruz Ruiz. Sudai Marie Cruz. Sabrina Brianna Marie Cupelli. Dwayne Allen Darnell. Jatoria Kiana Dawson. Jose Gabriel de la Cruz. Vito Santino de Lera. Dustin Reed Dresser. Tyler Zane Duska. Kendall Alexis Dykes. Jorge Ariel Echevarria. Jacqueline Enriquez. Christian Varnell Fashaw. Jermaine Douglas Fashaw II. Matthew Allen Fierstein. Shantavia Andrea Floyd. Douglas Lorenzo Fowler Jr. Aleida Talana Fraser. Alexander Lee Fraser. Brian Keith Fuller Jr. Brianna Jolyn Ganey. Randy Albert Gates. Antonio Daniel Jarina. Jordan Dale Gibson. Darwin Antonio Godfrey Jr. Garrett Wade Edward Gomes. Olga Lacey Gomez. Isamaris Gonzalez. Colton Allen Grego. Brandon Aaron Grease. Dante William Gunter. Zion Khalil Hamilton. Devin Anthony Harper. Juan Christian Herrera Arellano. Dylan Tyler Herzog. Tenebu Laron Hollis Jr. John Conley Hunley. Matthew Bryson Hunt. Anthony Lee Heisch. Emily Anna Rose Jakes. Joshua Andreo James. Charlene Andrea Jarrett. Ricardo Jimenez. Justin Lee Wayne Land. Kaylee Marie Lauderdale. Donovan Robert Lazell. Ryan Jacob Lee. Clay Robert Lewandowski. Sebastian Jarrett Lopez. Deanna Nicole Lynn. Derek Jacob McGuire. Edwin Yaciel Marcial Jimenez. Jasmine Ayana Sky Martin. 
Miles Noel Martin. Sadie Renee Martin. Alex Iram Martinez. Demetrius Darnell McCants. Keelan Jacob McCarthy. Tyler Iron McLinn. David Alejandro Mejia Urea. Skyler Rose Melvin. Brenaya Tache Merritt. Alexander Walter Malowski. Jonis Estrella Miras. Greg Mitchell Morgan. Christopher Michael Munt. Braxton Coleman Newkirk. Ola Kunle Ola Matoye Okunfe Jimmy. Cristal Marie Ortiz Marrero. Neida Ortiz Mota. Jeremy Andres Peyot Maldonado. Liana Emily Pereira. Lázaro Antonio Pérez Delgado. Tyler Joseph Piller. Tyranique Yashima Powell. Eleazar Quatent. Jamani Maya Rawls. Raul Enrique Rivera Santiago. Samuel Julian Rodriguez Jr. Damani Jalen Rose. Gabriella Lorraine Rose. Bradley Thomas Rush II. Gaffwood St. Brew. James Anthony Seberg. Paul David Shelton. Chase Lee Seitz. Colin Xavier Spurlock. Alexandria Jade Stevenson. Avandre Malachi Sutherland. Kimberly Deanna Swingle. Alicia Deniria Thomas. Logan Anthony Thrasher. Carly Krissa Thurman. Adrian Ryan Todd. Brandon Alexander Torres. Kayron Jamar Turner. Isaiah Valsius. Derek Lee Vasquez Hernandez. Anthony Gabriel Velez. Aliyah Elise Green. Margaret Clorinda Santos. Shannon Michelle Waslieff. Jace Michael Waters. 
Haley Jane Watson. Brooke Elizabeth White. Javon Joshua Williams. Margaret May Williams. Nairi Mariah Williams. Sam Eugene Riles. Christelle and Marie Yafar. Saraya Samara Israel. <laughs> Dr. Gullett, on behalf of the Dinellan High School faculty and staff, may I present to you the class of 2021, the scene. The seniors before you have completed the requirements to be considered for graduation. Good evening, Donellan High School Class of 2021. It is my honor and privilege in accordance with Article 9 of the Constitution of the State of Florida and having satisfied the requirements set forth by Florida statutes, the State Board of Education, and the rules of the School Board of Marion County, with the authority delegated to me as the Superintendent of Schools, I now confirm your graduation from Marion County Public Schools. Graduates, Graduates, you may now turn your tassels. Congratulations. Graduates, please stand for the playing of the alma mater for Denolan High School.
Dinellon High School, class of 2021, you are officially dismissed. You may throw your cap.